Bangladesh has over 24.4 million cattle. That's the huge cattle population. Over 100 million rural people are involved in rearing cattle. This is an important asset and source of income for them. But these cattle are not protected by any insurance. That's not right, right? So why there is no cattle insurance? These are all traditionally reared animals with no ID. Therefore, the risk of insurance claim fraud is very high. Some IoT based technologies have been tried out for cattle ID, but these are too expensive for rural farmers. We need something that's low cost and reliable. What we are developing is a muzzle based cattle identification process using machine learning technology. Muzzle prints of cattle are much like human fingerprint. No two muzzles are similar. Let's have a demo of how our technology works. First, you have to register a farmer with some basic information. Under that farmer profile, you will have to register cattle with specific information like age, color, type, etc. The key is to take multiple images of the cattle. All of this would be done using a mobile app. The muzzle images will be used to form an ID of the cattle at a central server. When a claim arises, the same app will be used to capture the muzzle prints of the dead cattle. Then it would be sent to the HO for verification and settlement. The claim settlement officer will check if the muzzle imprints of the dead cattle match with any of the cattle ID stored in its database. If the match result is 85% or above, that would confirm that the dead animal and the originally profiled animal are the same cattle. For each cattle ID, we will charge 0.6 US dollar. This is 4% of the total annual premium for an average cattle as prescribed by the insurance regulator. This is a lot cheaper than any existing technology including RFID tag and bolas. If we get 50,000 cattle registered in a year, we will get to break even point and anything beyond 50,000 will earn us profit. In 5 year time, we will register 500,000 cattle in a year making us a profit of 200,000 US dollar.